Champs, welcome back for Summer of Champions and the third of the new characters voted by the community. Let's take a look at Indy Hartwell, impressive, <laughs> yes, impressive, at six star bronze. Let's take a look at her poster. So she's a defensive acrobat modern era. A, a trainer all the way to 26k blue gems do 40% more damage and moves that generates green gems will create three more green gems links we have the modern era and gears no extra sets of gears so let's take a look at a first build for Hartwell and it is the all-in submission and very impressive Probably the best submission in the game next to the Ministry of Darkness Undertaker. So it generates 35, the sleeper hold generates 35 random submission gems and do 531,463 damage for 6 freaking turns. Remaining submission gems turns into silence gems. We have the finisher, the springboard elbow drop. I don't even know if we're gonna get to see it. Deals 489,569 damage and makes 25 silence gems into yellow gems. And the ripcord and knee strike deals 264,367 damage and chooses 6 gems to make it to blue gems. Auto rush for that build. Like I said, I'm going all in with the submission. Again, Tatanka. Tatanka only over 21k yellow move starts with two more move points and yellow submission moves do 65% more damage per turn you have Tatank Tatanka 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 if you have Tatanka here at over 26k the yellow submission moves will do 100% more damage per turn. I have zombie AJ Styles. Yellow submission moves last three more turns. And moves that generates yellow gems will create one more. We have Drew Tech. Yellow submission moves do 50% more damage per turn. And yellow submission moves last one more turn. And Logan Paul. Any color submission moves do 40% more damage per turn. Again, if you have him, this is over 21k. If you have him at over 26k, that's 50% more damage per turn and an extra turn. So. Without having Tatanka here at 26k and Logan Paul at 26k, look at this freaking impressive submission uh one million three hundred and fifty five thousand two thirty one for ten turns ten turns that's 13.5 million damage so i don't think a six star bronze will survive and she's coming in in the R12. So again, my submission is ready. Now look at this. 13, just over 13 million health points for Lita. So I'm gonna hit first the ripcord knee strike. Because I wanna see, I wanna be able to see that move. We're not gonna be able to see probably the springboard elbow drop, but this basically will reload both yellows. Let's go with the ripcord here. This is the move, nice animation. And let's load the finisher without any cascades. Boom, finisher's ready. Gonna hit the finisher, but there's no silence gems on my board. So I'm gonna go with the sleeper hold. 12.65 million health points for Lita. And here, this will do over 13.5 million that's ridiculously impressive wow and this is without logan paul at 26k and tatanka at 26k 
unbelievable Indy R12. So let's take a look at a second build for Heart Well. So we have the triple red big boot, deals 289, 729 damage, and chooses five gems to make it into one turn countdown gem. That will make six random gems into multiplied gems of strength four. We have the stun gun, deals 301,714 damage, and chooses a five by four area to make it into multiplied gems of strength five. And the rocket kick. Finisher deals 254,074 damage and makes 25 multiplied gems into blue gems. Entourage for that build. Butch, the red MP trainer. We have uh, Matt Hardy Showboat multiplied gems that generated from moves will increase their strength by two. Uh, coaches, we have King Seamus blue gems do 12,000 more damage. And Veteran Salute. Cena green gems do 15% more damage moves that generates countdown gems will create one more countdown gem and <clears throat> why am I uh, using Cena here just to take a look at the skill plate so I'm, I'm using this zombie plate here whenever you make four or more countdown gems increase your gem damage by 50% and reduce your opponent's gem damage by 35% for two turns and the judgment day plate so eyes of judgment when you make six or more countdown gems deplete six mp from each of your opponent's moves so let's take a look at indy hartwell so all three moves ready here triple red uh, i'm using again butch uh, red mp trainer uh, for this one for this match uh, i'm gonna do a second match triple red and I'm going to put uh, Andre the Giant Striker there. So that will boost my uh, multiplied gems strength. But probably it's not going to be a turn one. So let's go with the big boot first. Here we go. Six. Boom. Deplete. Bye bye. No more. All. Lita's moves are completely down the ground. Let's go with this stun gun here. And then I'm gonna go with the finisher. So again, the rocket kick. Flat damage, 733,000. And makes 25 multiplied gems into blue gems. And that's why I have King Seamus there. That's 9.5 reduced to 8 something. And Lira can't kick out. Bleem, boom, bam. Beam, boom, bam. That's a turn one for Indy. So let's take a look at the same build with Andre the Giant Striker as a trainer. Okay, so again, the triple red here, but this time I'm using Striker Andre. So red move starts with two more move points and multiplied gems. Uh, generated from moves will increase their strength by one again let's hit this those countdown gems will deplete the mp from all her moves six mp here we go uh, i don't have a red match on the board so let's go with blue here Now I have my red match. Okay, so now I'm gonna go again with the big boot. Just to use that uh, zombie plate here with those countdown gems. Boom. Each of those red gems are doing 310,933 but we don't want red here we want blue the blue is doing 454 720 let's go with the stun gun and put multiply gems of strength 8 okay so these are doing over 500,000 let's go with the finisher the rocket kick 
boom 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 that's 18 million damage Indy Hartwell impressive you bet so that's it champs for this character preview of Indy Hartwell impressive as we can see here um, I hope you enjoyed this one champs if you did please give a like and if you haven't subscribed already please do until next time Benny's out.